fucking moron. <laughs> Saiyan buddies? No. Why would you ask me that? That's a franchise I've not loved in a long time. A long time. Yeah, what the hell, it's about time I reviewed these damn things. Hey guys, what's up? It's Big Jack Films here, and welcome to another review. And it's hard to believe in the last 10 years of being on YouTube, I have yet to cover the Star Wars saga. But of course, I'm gonna see where it all began with the original Star Wars. But first, I want to see what you are, my little friend, and where you come from. Wait a minute, the original unaltered version from 1977? That's impossible, even for a computer! I thought these things were a myth that they still existed. Well, 
If that's the case, I might as well take a look at them and review them as they were originally released. <laughs> what the hell? Jack, Jack, do you copy? Do you copy, please? Come in. Yes, Nick Jackson, what is it? We've got an incoming fleet coming in to Earth's atmosphere. And me and the Ultra Guard can't hold them off for long. We've been totally wiped out. <laughs> we need some- Oh, shit! Discs. Guard them well. Keep yourself hidden. A small price to pay for your title. Go! This presence... I felt it before. Jack Buchanan. Lord Vader. I sense much uncertainty in you. Just, uh, a little unexpected to see you here. I see you have plans to review the original Star Wars trilogy. Look, whatever it is, I don't have it. I'm just planning to review the films as they were originally really intended to be. Your plan is as clear as day. A decoy rebel ship captured, while a Skywalker Ranch space station was raided and classified files were stolen and subsequently tracked down to your home planet. I have no idea what you're talking about. Do not try to resist me, Mr. Buchanan. The original trilogy is no more. Master Lucas has seen to that. The special editions are how he has always envisioned Star Wars to be, and they are all that ever have or ever will exist. Yes, my lord. We have even seen to it your piddling nation's pathetic excuse for a literary archive believes that. Hey, 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 hey! Your fried finger's getting a little close there. I'm having frickin' intimate issues with it. For that matter, how the hell are you even still alive? Last time I checked, you killed your boss and made amends with your son! What, did Disney decide to clone you so you can be more marketable? Christ, you're even more of a puppet than Yoda! Be careful not to choke on your criticisms. What, is David Caruso writing your puns for you now? The hour is later than you think. I have come back for a greater task. What else is new? Did your old boss come back with that order of fried lava legs? You will find out soon enough, for I serve a new master now. Lord Vader, we found this droid in the armory. Good work, Commander. See to it that the bounty hunter hands her over to the hut. Vader! Vader, you vile bastard! She has nothing to do with this! I will foresee to it that she will not be harmed, but to ensure that you review the trilogy properly, she will be under the care of the hut until your task is complete. My new master will meet with you shortly. Guard the facilities. I have a bad feeling about this.
Anyway, since I have no other choice, let's take a look at a film that sparked an empire with Star Wars. Episode 4, A New Hope. You know what? Fuck this 1997 CGI piece of crap! Ah, that's much better. And more practical. Luke, trust me. You know, come to think of it, Obi-Wan reminds me a lot of a certain Jedi-turned YouTuber that I can't seem to get a grasp on. Jack. 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 Master Rice Duke? You must find me, Jack. In order to defeat the dark side, you must be instructed by me and learn the ways of the Force. But that's impossible! I don't have a ship! Hell, I don't even have a mini chlorine account! Ow! Mind your prequel to Tom. You'll find a ship and a captain in the most likely of places. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Hello? Rice Duke? You just gonna leave me hanging? <sighs> you know, sometimes, guys, the Jedi can be some vague assholes. Oh, speaking of assholes... God! Fuck, 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 shit, shit! Lucas, why the fuck are you doing this to your movies? Yeah! <sighs> Damn it. Never. I'll never destroy these films. And as pathetically predictable as your return may be, you have failed, my lord. I am a true Star Wars fan, and always will be, just like those who saw the film 40 years ago before me. If you will not be turned against it, you will be destroyed. Sand. It's rough and irritating and it gets everywhere. No!
stormtrooper? Watch your mouth, Jake. Get off this rock on your own. Josh? What the hell are you doing here? As Duke said, you need a pilot. I'm your man. Come on! from Blockbusters to a Monday. Come on! Oh, is it that a retro reference? Timmy, get us out of here! Wow, looks like you're doing a bit of renovation! Hey, Steve, did you put the parking brake on the Falcon? Well, you can forget about those Imperial slugs. This ship's fast enough to outrun them. What's the matter? You can afford the Falcon, but not a Wookiee? Hey, money talks, kid. And she's still strong enough that she can still put up a fight. So what's the plan, kid? Well, if Rice Duke is any indication, you gotta take me to where he's hiding. With the Empire back in town, the Jedi must be taking extra precautions. Once we group with him, we go rescue 18. You know, you've been with that hunk of metal for so long now. What's that droid carrying that's so blast important? The negative prince of the unaltered trilogy. Along with a fuck ton of other information I would rather the Empire not finding out about. Plus, with my facility under their control, that's definitely not good for the whole universe. So if you think this is just about money, we're actually in a real shit show. We have Rice Duke's location. But what then? We'll have to make contact with our allies in the Republic. If we're to stand a chance against taking Earth back from the Empire, we're gonna need all the help we can get. In the meantime, I've got a trilogy to finish. a great disturbance in the mythical energy known as the Force. As have I. So too have the Jedi. While they are fled throughout the galactic universe due to the resurface of the Empire, they seek to return an ally with our old enemy. The great warrior who defeated us in the Great War 15 years ago, and who now seeks to review the Armalta Trilogy. I believe him to still see goodness in your creator, George Lucas. There is no more good in Lucas. Any that was left was snuffed out when he made the Blu-ray changes. The Force is strong with him. If he reclaims that power, he could destroy us. The Great Warrior must never return and therefore cannot be allowed to harness the power of the Jedi. There is darkness within him, Master. You know this to be true as well. Skywalker may have failed to be lured to the dark side, but if Jack were to turn, he could prove to be just as powerful an ally. Yes. Yes. He would be a great asset. Can it be done? 
I swear to you, my master, he will join us or die. <sighs> no matter the outcome, we do have those who were once his masters become those who will destroy him. Master Rice Duke, it's been far too long. You got a lot of nerve coming back here after what you pulled. <gasps> this power is far beyond what I've ever felt. The dark side, no, light side, something far greater. Not strength, nor weakness, but a will that is binding within. Something is very... Very, very strong. Something within you. You have changed. If you think I'm still of the weak-minded, you better think again. <laughs> Your old critic, how are you doing? It's so good to see you! Yeah, so good to see you. Why are you here? Wait a minute, I should know. I sent for Josh as the pilot. Is that the Falcon? Well, I figured you'd know I'd swing by. Oh, and the Empire's taken over my planet, and on top of that, my droid is captured. Why do you think I'm here? This is serious shit, Rice Duke. The situation is a lot more complicated. So you've come here for the right reason, then. Come. And that's the situation, Rice Duke. The enemy has returned, and the Empire have the Republic on the run. Unbelievable. And I thought you destroyed him for good. I thought I did. Christ, this bastard won't die so easily. If he has indeed returned, this could mean trouble for the other worlds. We cannot risk the return of the Great War. I can't allow more people to die. You must do what you feel is right, of course. What choice will you make? Our main objective is to get the droid. After that, we regroup with our forces, and we retake the planet. I suggest you try again, Jack. Let go of your conscious self. Let instinct take hold. The Jedi are well organized, but if they are to fight, they'll need a leader to guide them. What of the Masters? They can only do so much. If you are to lead, you must learn the ways of the Force as you once did. Learn before you can truly defeat. If that's what it takes, I guess I could take another course. Bear in mind, Master, my uh, skills are a little rusty. Now we must begin. Where do we start? If you are to once again gain the power of the Force, you must first have faith in it. To do this, you must pick up where you left off. Tell me, my apprentice, what was your last review on? Obviously Star Wars. Right. Well, what's next? Breathe. Just breathe. Now. What do you see? What do you feel? I see pain. Suffering. The future. The dark side. The continuation. The Empire strikes back. So, what do you gather on this film? A sense of lightning striking twice. Well, I can't really 
blame them for that. I mean, these toys are pretty cool. Yeah, I've got my own collection of action figures, so what? <laughs> we got you now, Sono. There's no escaping this time. Not if I can help it, I'll save you, buddy. Pew, 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 pew. Jess, stop fucking around and get back to the review. Ugh, fine. Joey, I think we need a new hobby. Yeah, I know. If we were in Andy's house, it'd be totally different. However, positive cannot be balanced without the negative. If not, it can lead to over-intentions. Or worse, the dark side. You ask if there are problems with the film? This is your final test. Look for a balance. Feel the force flowing through you, and let it choose your fate. Remember always, the crystal is the heart of the blade. The heart is the will of the force. Big Jack Films, your training is complete. Always have faith in who you are. Shut the fuck up, Grandpa Gohan! Thank you, my friend. But now we must make haste to Earth. Captain Josh! Ready the ship. You two go on ahead. I will catch up later. Wait. You're not coming with us? We need you. Well, someone will have to make contact with the Jedi Council for the battle to come. I appreciate that. May the Force be with you. Yeah, you too. Star Wars Rogue Squadron for the Nintendo 64. A fantastic, awesome game and a lot of fun. I recommend it to everybody. <coughs> what is that, R2? A message from Big Jack Films? Well, patch him in. Ah. Oh, God, look at me. I look like Hatsuda Miku up in this shit. Oh, hey, Brad. Good to see ya. I see your review of Rogue Squadron seems to have paid off because I need your help. Look, this is about your copy of Battlefield 1. I lost it, okay? No, you idiot! Look, you're not gonna believe me, but I just caught up with the Rebel Alliance, and we're gonna make an airstrike on the city of Toronto to take it back from the Empire. Well, I kinda figured I'd start a story circling the Earth was your fault. Well, bottom line, the airstrike needs a guide to direct them through the attack. I need you to pilot an X-Wing and command the squadron. How do you expect me to drive an X-Wing? I can't even drive a good round in Mario Kart. Well, what if I were to tell you that your own personal X-Wing was piloted, licensed, and controlled 
by a Nintendo system. Attention Nintendo Squadron, you are being directed to the Rebel fleet. Stay clear of all enemy ships. Good luck and may the force be with you. Coming up on Endor now. That's where Jabba's got the droid. Well, let's make this quick. The Empire would have taken control of the city by now. Here's our exit. Greetings, Jabba. You're looking delightfully more faker than I expected. Hmm. Huh. Um... Wow. <laughs> you doing okay, babe? All I feel is disgusted. Don't worry, honey. I got this. Oh, well, you see, I've, uh, come to clean your sewage pipes. Why the hell do you think I'm here, Mama June? I've come to reclaim my droid, nothing more. You can either profit by this, or be destroyed. It's your choice, but I warn you not to underestimate my power. Hey, can I finish this guy off now? Eighteen, please, we're talking here! Look, if you want to audition for my 600 pound life on A&E, I can work into talking with the producers. That's it. <laughs> Come on, I had that completely under control. I was going to fight a rancor and shit. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Vader will pay me a fortune for you, Jedi. Looks like there's no escaping this time. Don't worry, honey, I'm way ahead of you. It's time to send these bastards to hyperspace. What took you so long? Oh, you know, slug monsters, pig people, walking on the scent of a hentai. How you doing, 18? I'm going to go change. You two kill some time. Oh, we're about to. We got some leftovers coming in hot out of the microwave. There they are. Stay sharp. What's to be scared of, you big coward? I take it back, I'm too scared too. <sighs> Why won't you die? Hey! Look out! You got any bright ideas? Yeah, get in one of the gunner seats in the back and haul ass! Roger! So I said no cameos! Dog, Timber! Yeah, no, I don't mean you! Alright, we have one shot, hang on! Uh, <laughs> boom, boom, baby! <laughs> Bro, that was awesome! 
I always wanted to do that. <laughs> hey, we are not going to be late. Let's get a move on. So how'd she look in the sleeve outfit? Hey, save your guttered mind for Ayaname back on Earth. Set course for the Republic fleet. And with pleasure. <laughs> Well, with the amount of action we just had, it kind of sums up the movie we're going to be reviewing today. So let's take a look at the final installment of the Star Wars Saga. Unless you count 7, 8, and 9, but that's for another time. This is Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. Master Rice Duke, how many men? 150. That's it? Hey, it's better than nothing. The rest of us are caught in the other battles of the Galactic Universe. I only brought those who are available. <sighs> It'll have to do. Now let's go over the plan. Patch me through the fleet. I'd like to thank you all for helping Earth in this time of need. Things have been peaceful since the Great War, but now evil has risen again. We have learned that Darth Vader has been resurrected by a greater magic than that of the Force, and is preparing to send an Imperial fleet to invade the Earth's forces. The plan is simple, with a full-on attack against the Imperial forces in the land and the air. Rebel spies have managed to gather information that the Empire holds hostilities at the heart of the Toronto City. That would make a great spin-off movie. The attack forces will focus on the grounds and in the skies. General Montello will command a squadron to occupy the Imperial air support, while I will defend forces in the ground battle. The enemy forces focus solely on stormtroopers. However, rebel spies have discovered that Vader commands a gathering of Sith Lords. I know this is a fearful time for some, but if we do not stand and fight, then the Earth system will be tainted by the dark side. To simply put it, without Earth, you all don't exist. Man your ships, and may the Force be with you. Alright boys, we're entering the atmosphere now. Prepare to launch towards the city. Roger, Gold Leader. Hey, I finally made it into this thing. Master, the Republic fleet is making a strike on our forces. Send forth the Sith Knights! Yes, my master. All squadrons to me! For a break, we're gonna put this sucker on autopilot and be good to go.
fighters fast. I know, but we're outnumbered and running out of tricks. What is this, your guard? The hell was that? I don't know why I let you play your silly games. Destructive disc! Fucking show off. Damn Marines. Alright boys, we just might win this one. Get them everything you got! Trust me. Yeah. <laughs> 
you. I know Lord Vader's tactics. No, it's not you, is it, Anakin? Who are you? Imposter. Violence! The spirit of Vader does not live within that suit. Someone else has taken the mental. I'll see to it that the UN is informed on the situation and make sure that our solar system stays out of reach of the Galactic Senate. Well, hopefully that'll be the end of all reality breakers for now. Be sure to give the warrior our thanks once again for bringing our alliances together. If he ever shall need us, we are only three million light years away. But be vigilant, Reister. If the dark forces are ever to attack again, we must be informed. May the force be with you. Eric, you wanna get some drinks, man? Yeah, I could really go for a glass of blue milk. By the way, don't you have to return the Falcon? Yeah, I'll keep it for one more day and give it a ride back. The extra fee is gonna be a bitch, though. That wasn't such a big deal. No. I'm afraid this battle is only the beginning.
writing the new Star Wars series. This is my life. This is the hole I live in, the cave I hide in. The original notes and the original outline are uh, 15 pages. This whole early part was written to set up the films that were made. There is drama uh, here. Uh, 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 we are uh, here. Right? Is my big uh, 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 microscope? Uh, 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 Jar Jar is a cute. Uh, uh, we get Jar Jar working because he's a funnier uh, character than we're going to have. Uh, well, uh, again, it's like poetry. Uh, if they rhyme, uh, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. Uh, uh, uh,